लाइव आप खामोश हो जाओ आप लोग जरा السلام علیکم ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹ بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم رب دی زد می علما سو ان اور لاسٹ چیپٹر کوارڈینیشن اینڈ ریسپونسز 1 وی ہیو ڈسکسڈ دی نروس سسٹم اف مامنس دی برین دی اسپائنل کارڈ دی نروس دیٹ ارائز فرام دی اسپائنل کارڈ دیٹ از دی پیریفرل نروس سسٹم دی کریئل نروس and the spinal nerves and then uh, we discussed that how uh, the mo- uh, the impulse travel um, in the nervous system the reflex arc and uh, reflex action and then we came to know about uh, uh, the sensitive sensi- sensitivity and irritability of uh, the human uh, that is the ability to respond to a stimulus is the sensitive sensitivity of that organism the response is usually uh, in a form of movement which is beneficial to the organism for example the plant uh, grow towards the light or uh, if we talk about the single cell organisms like euglena we can see that uh, it swims towards the light so that it can uh, perform its vital functions of the life and uh, if we talk about the insects and other they move away from the light to save them from uh, intensity of the light even the invertebrates have nervous system which control their activities and reaction to the env- uh, environment to their surrounding however uh, they don't have well developed brain Uh, but when we talk about vertebrates like fishes or uh, the human we have the nervous system which is very well developed and high, highly specialized and uh, for that reason they uh, these organisms have highly specialized sense organs as well which are known as receptors The receptors are basically the organ which receive the changes taking place in the environment. As we talked about, uh, talk about earlier, about the uh, microorganisms like euglena, it swims towards the in- intensity of light, or if the light becomes too much intense that it can destroy its structure, it moves away from it. So the receptors are the organ which receives the changes taking place in our environment. so the receptors are present in the well uh, developed organisms like fishes like uh, human the vertebrates especially then in invertebrates like insects and worms they also have some sort of receptors like in insects eyes are present compound eyes are present to uh, uh, respond to the changes taking place in their environment So uh, when we talk about humans there are many types of receptors which perform different function <clears throat> So uh, there are many types of receptors in humans like photoreceptors photoreceptors are responsible for receiving light they are responding to light for it perceive light uh, uh, the main receptor in human being for um, for perceiving light is eye sonoreceptors that perceive sound the receptor uh, in human being for sound is our ears the chemical receptors the chemical receptors which perceives to chemicals like uh, the um, we are having the humans are having tongue and nose for responding to the chemical stimulus
uh, we humans have mechanical receptors as well that perceive to pressure and the receptor uh, for these me mechanical uh, stimulus uh, is the skin which can feel the change in temperature the pressure uh, and all the other things as well the other there are other receptors types of receptors are there in human body which can feel pain, hunger, thirst, pleasure, emotion, etc. 